Sometimes our Chromebooks can have problems that are best solved by wiping the Chromebook and starting over from scratch. The good news is none of your schoolwork will be lost because it's all saved to Google Drive automatically. To start doing what we call a power wash, you're gonna hold down the escape button, the refresh button, and the power button. That should bring us to this screen. It's asking us to put in a recovery media. To do that, we just hold down Control and D. And it's gonna ask us to turn verification off. We just hit Enter. And again, it's gonna ask us just to hit Enter. Once we've done that, the computer will reboot. And once we hear that sound, we know we're ready to go. So I'm gonna come over here and press the let's go button. From here, you're gonna choose your Wi-Fi network to connect to. If you're at school, you're gonna pick Watertown Public. If you're at home, you're gonna choose your Wi-Fi network at home. Once your Chromebook is connected to Wi-Fi, it's gonna ask you to accept and continue. And it's gonna really quickly check for updates before it enrolls with the school system. All right, once it says enrollment complete, we just say done, and it's gonna ask us to sign in. Your computer has now been successfully power washed. When you first log in, you do have to be a little patient as the Chromebook will start installing extensions and, and updating some things in the background. So it might be a little slow and weird for the first few minutes.